Hey guys, Jimbo Ivan here, and today what I have for you is some Boom Beach gameplay. Today what you're doing is we're pretty much facing Dr. Terror, and hopefully came claiming victory. Uh, so this is just normal Dr. Terror. We're going to be trying out pretty much the heavies, zookas, and medic combos, and let's see if we can pretty much get it to work. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and challenge it, and just, so first stage, really, really easy to beat, guys. Send a barrage in there. Should destroy it. Or leave it really low that we can just uh, get rid of those two structures right over there. And we'll send in two bombs to get rid of that defense. And then we should be able to just relatively just destroy this really, really easily. So there we go. We got our uh, guys in. And then uh, I'll just target here to uh, pretty much flare to this right over here. And then at the exact same time, we'll go ahead and send a barrage in just to remove all these defenses over here. And then uh, we'll send in another missile right over there just to kind of pretty much lower the defenses and stuff like that because it does lower the building if you do destroy pretty much the defense around. If you guys don't know that, you probably do. Um, but yeah, we'll just lower the uh, defense, uh, the pretty much the HQ, which is pretty cool. So the next stage, really easy again. Go ahead and flare that. Uh, sorry, uh, pretty much. Um, what is it again? We'll pretty much barrage that over there, and oh my god, it survives with nothing. And then we'll go ahead and barrage this right over there, and that should get rid of the defense behind. There we go. Got rid of that, and our medic should be coming to heal up our guys over here, which is really good. There we go. So, getting a lot of health back. I don't even think they'll take any damage. And then we got, what do we have here? We got, um, we got that, which should be destroyed, and then we'll just send in like five bullets over there. There we go. Got it destroyed. All good. Um, so yeah. Pretty much the first two are really, really easy stages to take down when you're doing Dr. Terror. The first, uh, actually, more lines, the first, like, five or six, I would say, are the f really easy. Well, more like five, and then after that, gets a little bit tricky. Uh, so, come on, there we go, got rid of that. Um, and then that should destroy it, there we go. Okay, good, I just hate those uh, pretty much cannons, because they're really, really annoying to pretty much deal with everything like that. So let's go ahead and send in the rest of our guys over here, and then, there we go, We've got healers coming in that are, like, protecting them and stuff like that, which is really good. They don't even take any damage, which is really awesome, just because of the healers pretty much putting in their support and all that stuff, which is really good. Um, and then after that, we should be able to just pretty much target this thing right over here, and we should be able to get that uh down so let's just go ahead and target that right over there um and there we go so full hp which is really good so now they're just sitting there like being really really cool healers so just shoot a missile in there it doesn't even do anything okay next next stage really really simple let's just go ahead and do it again um well no of course another stage so we'll get rid of this cannon right over here and then we'll get rid of this pretty much the rocket launcher over there um it's the next target, so there we go, we got rid of that, and then we have this row here, so we'll go blow that up, and then this row over here, which should get destroyed, there we go, we got it, uh, and now we can send in our troops, so, changing up the combo, guys, I'm pretty much getting my medics so that they stop, and then after they stop, I can send in these troops, because now they're a little bit closer, which I find to be a little bit better, um, and yeah, I just tried it on the first one, it was better, so why not do it on this one too, so that they don't have to run all the way back and everything like that. Um, what I really like, guys, is also when pretty much I put a little, like, smoke on these buildings right here, over here, because, like, it's just, it looks kind of cool, to be honest. I, I don't know why it looks so good, it just looks really awesome. So we'll go ahead and just stun this, and then um, go ahead and shoot a bomb at that, just destroy it. And then, yeah, we just got the base relatively easy. Uh, again, so we're getting a lot of, what's it called, Dark Crab. We just got four for that, which is really amazing. So, yeah, he's talking to us again. Uh, so we have this stage now, a little bit trickier. Still really, really easy because these two, two of the biggest, pretty much main structures are together. So we'll easily get rid of both of them. And now what we'll do is we'll send in our guys who are here. At the exact same time, we'll send in our medics, which should be able to just go in here. But then what we'll do is we'll go ahead and stun this area right over here, just so that we can pretty much uh, not have to worry about the troops and all that stuff. we got a lot of gunboat energy, so I'm going to go ahead and get rid of these pretty much defenses over here. Uh, this barely survives, unfortunately. So go ahead and stun that area right there, get rid of all those defenses. And then we got a few guys coming back here. Yes, they are now moving into the center, which is good. Um... And then hopefully 
they like start turning in a way to uh pretty much the center because they're starting to do that now. Uh so let's just go ahead and barrage right over there. And there we go. So that was really, really easy too guys. We pretty much just uh just destroyed this base, which was really awesome. Um so yeah, I'm gonna do it again guys. Did we lose any casualties? No, we did not. And look at all that uh powder pattern all that stuff. Oh we can actually upgrade our sawmill because we have uh we just have so much resources, which is awesome. Um, so, ooh, this is a really easy base. We just got the shock launcher here, which we should be able to just really just wreck this shock launcher. It's not, it's not like that strong or whatnot. It just takes a few attacks uh, to destroy. And then, yeah, we should be able to just go through here now. Uh, the only problem is going to be that's uh, pretty much cannon right over there. So we're going to actually have to be a little bit careful in terms of just getting these defenses and then waiting till we get another defense what we're going to do is pretty much remove these two like these two uh what's it called flamethrowers and then after that what we're going to do guys is we're going to turn in this way so that we can uh not take any damage here now what i'm going to go ahead and do guys is i don't want these guys getting hurt or harmed or whatnot so we're trying to heal them up which is good they don't look like they're getting effective affected which is good so we should be able to keep them alive Go ahead and shock that area over there, guys, just so we don't have to worry about that. Um, and then our guys should start to target this. I think we did lose a few troops, unfortunately, which is not good. But it's still alright. Um, and then we're going to pretty much target that building right over there. At the exact same time, I'm going to go ahead and move this building right over here. Um, for my troops to pretty much move to this place right over here so they don't get affected. And then hopefully it does not... Oh, it just killed a few Zookas, unfortunately. Uh, now it should be targeting, yes it is targeting now, uh, pretty much our troops are over here, hopefully they do target my Zookas, heal them up a little bit, uh, but it's better to target, of course, my heavies, just so they can tank it all, which is good, um, and then, we, why don't we just do this, we'll go ahead and smoke, uh, pretty much smoke the mortar, because that's alright, and then yeah, we just got the base, so yeah, that was pretty good guys, we did lose some troops there, unfortunately, which really sucked, ouch, we lost 12 Zookas, not that good, guys, unfortunately. So let's go ahead and speed that up really quickly. Um, and then we'll raid this again. So hopefully we can win against Dr. Terra Stage 7. This is a little bit harder stage, guys, um, for us. So, yeah, we'll go ahead and pretty much send a barrage right over here. And then that should lower this building to a two-shot right over there, which is good. And now what we have to worry about is simply this uh, cannon right over here, which we should be able to get rid of with that one... Barrage right over there. Unfortunately, it wasn't enough. This is, I think, this base yet yeah, has some, a few overpowered structures. Unfortunately, so we're gonna have to try it out again, guys. Um, and be a little bit cautious. So we don't really care about that flamethrower there. So what we're gonna do is try to send a more concentrated fire on this area right over here, so we can possibly get it. Um, there we go. We got rid of that. And now what we have is pretty much this right over here. So. I think this can be destroyed. No, it cannot be destroyed by two shots. So what we're going to do is be a little bit careful now on this pretty much defense. So how much does it do? It does pretty much pretty good damage. So we'll go ahead and stun that area right over there. Hopefully our troops target that uh, structure really soon because we don't want to lose our troops. And we got one guy targeting the flamethrower, which is actually pretty good. So now we got our troops coming into here. Let's go ahead and target that defense right over there, guys. Um, don't want them to be harmed. So we send them back a little bit, and then we should be able to save them over here. Uh, so we're just waiting for them to pretty much reveal themselves. Uh, oh no no no! Don't die my don't don't die Zookas! No, can't lose their Zookas. Okay, so getting targeted over here. So go ahead and stun that area right over there. Uh, then we'll pretty much go after the cannon right over here, and then after we pretty much destroy that cannon right over there, which we should destroy. Fast, we'll go ahead and turn our Zookas and all our troops over here. The exact same time, we'll go ahead and shock this area. Uh, so that our, pretty much our troops don't get affected. Oh my god, we just lost all our Zookas. No, that is not good. Okay, so go ahead and stun this area over here. So we can pretty much conserve all our um, guys over here. I believe we may lose this battle because we lost all our Zookas there. From the one, one motor right over there that just completely wrecked our base, guys. I don't think we can win, so we'll go ahead and retreat our troops so that we don't lose them all. Oh, that really sucked. We needed our Zookas there to win the thing, but probably, I don't think we can win against this base, guys. It's a little bit tricky. 
We lost, oh, 20 Zookas. That is not that good. But unfortunately, guys, that is going to be it for this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, a like would really be appreciated. And if you really enjoyed this video, guys, make sure to hit the subscribe button. But this has been Jimbo Evan, and I'll see you guys later. And make sure to apply to the Jim Craft Network for a 70% revenue share. And make sure to click the link in the description for pretty much free gems and just diamonds and boom beach by using a simple program called cash for apps which is just a really really cool system messed up on that uh pretty much outro there sorry for that guys but yeah that is it guys this has been chimbo evan and i will see you guys later bye